The thing is, a lot of the time people ask me, Felipe, when is the best time to go to Cocos Island? I could go on, give you a dissertation about it, but the answer is, best time to go to Cocos Island is now. This December, my friends, was wow. The best December I've done in Cocos Island in years. Crystal clear water, warm temperatures for diving with wetsuit optional, and then the amount of life was beautiful incredible look at these snappers spawning i was almost crying during this dive so excited and so moved by seeing all this action happening and then it was not only that kind of life it was also sharks 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 it was exciting we had galapagos basically manuelita punta maria los amigos on point the tigers in manuelita it's just every single time you go there, it looks like we're chumming the water, but simply we're not. These tigers are just patrolling around that rock non-stop, I think all day long. And it's amazing for you as a diver to get close to an animal that is two times the size of a hammerhead. We had it on video and people were like, wow, for real, these sharks are big. And big numbers was the hammerheads. The hammerheads in those two trips of December. For me, I had so many dives with score 8 or 9 during these two last trips, it was insane, wow, it's simply like a river flowing underneath you, above you, and this shot in Alcyon is a long shot, so you have to be patient, but take a look at this, this basically is like one minute and a half of sharks, enjoy my friends, and remember, the best time to go to Cocos Island is now. Happy holidays everybody, see you next year for more adventures under the water.